Well, thank you, Madam Secretary. Thank you. Both uh, for what you had to say as well as for the last four years. Uh, let me just take advantage of my position and ask the, uh, the first question. Uh, you gave uh, an extraordinarily comprehensive talk that touched on, I think you called them, the many levers of American uh, influence and power and made the case for various forms of our power. So when it comes to putting it together, is there an Obama doctrine, is there a Clinton doctrine that somehow ties it together, gives a sense of priorities, helps explain what it is we should do and not do and how we should do it in the way that other doctrines historically have played that role? Well, I think that, uh, as you can tell from what I said, we believe that America must continue to be the indispensable nation and the global leader on behalf of peace, prosperity, and uh, progress, and that that requires us not only to lead alone, but also to build coalitions and networks uh, that will put responsibility uh, with others and expect them to play their role uh, in a rules-based uh, global order. Uh, so it's uh, uh, not uh, um, always uh, easy to uh, talk about what we are doing every day, everywhere in the world, but I think if you look at what we have done, we have certainly kept faith with that kind of uh, uh, mission.